Hello everyone and welcome back. It's Chuck Thunder and we're doing another episode of our Let's Play. Um, <clears throat> they don't really have anything major planned other than to show you what I've been doing a little bit lately. I've been working on a research that requires me to buy trade good type 2, which in this case is alcohol or, let's see, alcohol, dyes, ores, wares, and luxury goods. And... I chose alcohol to be the one that I'm doing because it's one that I actually have a skill in and I want to grind it um, not because I want to get the skill up necessarily I mean it doesn't hurt to um, and I could be in a, a, a job that has this favored and cuts this in half but my goal is not to really grind the alcohol skill the goal is to get this up the, the my required pages for my thesis to 3600 and I've been slowly grinding it away, just buying alcohol, because buying alcohol gets you five research pages. Well, that takes a while. The other option is to get rich, which requires to make 10 million ducats in a profit from a single trade. And that would give me 360. But for the time investment it's going to take and the money investment, which is the nice shortcut, if I wanted to, I could buy, you know, a bunch of goods and try to sell it for 10 million in profit. But... It's not what I want to do. It's just, it's going to waste a lot of my money. So, I'm just grinding the alcohol. And so, I learned that buying from, buying wine from Spain and going to some place and selling it back to Seville to buy more wine and go back to another place and sell it and go back to Seville to buy more wine, it's just too long. So, what I needed to do was I needed to bounce back and forth, obviously, between two places that both have alcohol that I could buy and sell in, in either location. So from my research by looking up alcohol grinding on Google and going to my blog spot that I love so much to use the one of the ways of doing so especially for someone in my nation uh, being Spanish is to jump back and forth between Marseille and Genoa or Bordeaux and, Fr and Nancy's if you're French London and Dover if you're English and Havana and Jamaica if you want to go that far out to the Caribbean. So in this case I'm going to do Marseille and Genoa. I feel like that's not too really too far from one another. The regions are going to take a little bit of time to sail back and forth to, but I can get this research done rather quickly. Um, I say rather quickly, but quickly for what it is. Um, faster than trying to waste a lot of money, so that's what I was going to plan on doing. So, that's my goal. I'm just going to show you what I do. Grinding skills a lot of times is sometimes buying a certain product over and over and over again and selling it. Well, look at that. we got assignable traits. So, we're going to go to my aid information. Sorry if it's loud. It's raining. And who got... Claudia did. What do we want to put her in? Lookout. No. Paymaster? No. She's got enough skills and everything, so at least to unlock all of her skills. So we'll do it in this one. Cool. Now we're here. I'm going to go to the commercial district. Now, obviously, uh, if I had wine, I would sell it here, and I do. Not sure if wine is going to sell well here, but... I bought it in Seville while it was there. Sell the wine. No, I'm not making any money. That's okay. I don't, I'm going to lose a little bit of money doing that, but that's okay. Yeah, because you can buy wine here. That's what I thought. Buy wine and buy brandy. Now, it says luxury goods would also boost my thing, so I'm going to buy some luxury goods. Seasonings was not one of them. So, buying all the luxury goods. I got about 200 and some odd pages for that, so that's not bad. And now we're going to go back to Genoa, Genoa, whatever you want to say. Make sure we have goods with us to get there. It's not that important. It's a short trip. Back on the seas again. It shouldn't be long before we get there. 
that's a nice ship. What ship is that? A Potosi. Very nice. Good cargo hold. This person has clearly stacked it in such a way that it is going to be mostly cargo and speed. Do you know you can get a steam engine in that ship? So yeah, they're, they're building that ship for speed. I've been using this guy not because of for speed, but because of the storage space. Uh, you know, my ship information that I have here. You guys know that I use this for my speed ship because it's got acceleration uh, and uh, good good vertical sail and horizontal sail, high wave resistance. It's a good maneuverable ship to get me out to sea very quickly. It's got decent cannons if I really had to fight with it. So, it's a good all-around ship right now. But this guy right here has got all the storage that I need. This is my first schooner. You guys are wondering why I still have it. I have it because it looks cool. I love the way that it looks, but it's really not that important that I keep it. I might sell it um, to somebody who's looking for it. So, or... And maybe we'll do a giveaway in this channel. If you're watching this video and you're keeping up with me on a regular basis and you're somebody who could use this ship and you're a newbie, maybe we'll get you this ship. It's a great ship. I'll read you the details for it so that way you're not getting a ship you don't uh, you can't fit in. You need a 24 adventure level, 12 trade level, and 0 battle levels. Probably one of the easiest ships to get into. And... It has emergency acceleration to help you go a little faster. Now I don't know that it's necessarily faster than the Sambuk. I don't even it's not even that much for the hold. It's just for the look. I wanted this ship because I wanted this look and I thought it would be faster. It's not. It's not faster than the Sambuk. It might be very similar to it. Um, but it was a nice little ship and I love the way it looked. If you like the paint job on it, by all means everybody, if you're looking for if you're looking for a nice ship. Maybe I'll sell you the original Chuck Thunder, the sail my Sailor Swift ship. And if I sell it to you, I mean, you know, as like a sweepstakes, somebody who reaches out, maybe I'll give it to you. Reach out to me in chat, or reach out to me in comments. Maybe you could be the lucky one. All right, so here we are. We're gonna sell our wine, our brandy, our luxury goods. Lose a little bit of money on the prunes. That's okay. And look at that looker. No other luxury goods are there. Nothing. So that's all we get. Wares was another one, but I don't see any wares. So we got our liquor. We bought that. And back to Marseille again. And this is working for my research and focus. We were at 1,300, now we're at 16. So if I get 300 every trip, it'll be a short order until we're done. So this is how I'm grinding my alcohol skill, as well as also getting this uh, research done. It's my main goal. Um, but this is how you guys can do it if you're in this region and you want a cheap way to do it. Um, also, let me, let me uh, iron out just a little bit more of how I'm going to give away my other ship here. Um, ship. ship information, ship inventory. Okay, so let's go over the ship and see how we're going to do this. Hmm. If you want to get this ship, what you need to do is you need to share my video at least once. That would be nice. Share the video, like the video, subscribe to the channel, show me that you've done that. And that's what I'll do. If you could show me that you've done one of those things, subscribe, like the 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 channel, uh, and uh, share it with somebody else in which that needed the uh, the the boost of help. Maybe that's something uh, I could take as a boost, and we'll do that something for you, and you'll get this schooner. Uh, ship. It's not the greatest ship, but if you're somebody who's just starting out and you want an extra ship, maybe you've got an, an aide that needs the ship, sure. Be my guest. Um, I'll be giving away Sailor Swift if you can do one of those things for me. Either like, subscribe, 
or show that you liked and subscribed or shared the video or have given it to somebody else who's gotten them hooked on it. Any evidence to show that you've helped me out. Ooh, ghost ships. I don't know anything about ghost ships. I know nothing about them. I wish I did. Someone else could explain to me if, what ghost ships are. I think they're all around here, yeah. Let's see. Oh, jeez. I might have made a poor choice. Oh, gosh. Danger. 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 Well. <laughs> Lesson learned. Well, everybody. If you don't know anything about ghost ships, don't participate. That would have been wise. <laughs> oh gosh, that's that was a poor choice. No explanation. Just chose poorly. I have no idea what happened. Well, everybody. That's another thing that can get you the ship if you want. Explain to me what happened. That was wild. I like how I have like one sailor and he can sail this entire ship on his own. Alright, we made it to safe waters. Alright everybody, hope you like this video. Really short one. Very simple. Grinding alcohol skill, grinding this research. And if you want that ship, do what I said earlier. Show me that you've done it. And you want it, let me know. Let me know in comments or in chat in the game. I will gladly help the other fellow player out. Everyone, thanks again for watching, and have a good one.